hello everyone so recently I got a few comments on my videos asking for help so the issue was for some people after the Windows update uh, the start menu this menu right here won't work uh, right now it works perfectly on my system so I can't tell you how it looks like when it doesn't work so I haven't had this issue so I just uh, looked up looked it up online and I found a fix I tried it on my friend's computer he had this issue and it works perfectly fine so first of all what you need to do is as a step one you need to right click on this bar and then you need to search for this task manager you see that now click on the task manager and a window like this will pop up you see okay now click on file and run new task as soon as you click on the run new task there will be this window and type in powershell it's spelled as p o w e r s h e l l and it will bring up this window this blue one right here I have another window right on here okay and now you need to type in sfc space slash scan now what this does is it scans your PC for your system files it goes to every folder and looks out for corrupted files now after it search for corrupted files what it does it tries to repair them in case it doesn't, uh, it was not able to repair them, I'll be uh, asking you to follow the step number two. Currently, just click enter after typing this, and it will start a process. And it wants me to be an administrator. Okay, so what you need to do is just pin this, pin this to the taskbar, and right click it, run as administrator. Type in again SFC space scan now. Okay, it's beginning the system scan. It will take around 10 to 15 minutes if there's an, any problem. In case there is a problem, it, it may take more than that. Now, in case it finds some uh, corrupted files, it will automatically repair them. But in some cases, it won't be able to repair them as they are just too broken. So what you need to do is you need to follow the step number two. The step number two is same as this. You need to open PowerShell just like this. Right click it. Open as administrator. And then you need to type in this command. It's called DISM space slash online space slash cleanup image space slash restore health. What it does is is it takes the list of the corrupted files suppose there's this file like 123.exe and it's corrupted like it's beyond repair what it would do is go to the Microsoft server take a copy of that file and bring it back to your system now what you need to do is you need to run this command and write this command I'll be leaving the copy of these commands both the commands in the description you can copy it from there you need to write these commands on your PowerShell and you need to press enter it will automatically search for the corrupted files and fix them you see okay so that was our step two a uh, step three is somewhat a simple step but it may help in some cases what you need to do is right now windows has not fixed this issue so in case you are watching this video after a week or something windows might have fixed it so what you need to do is you need to go to the search bar and type in updates windows updates Okay, now here is this button this calls that says check for updates you need to click that it will check for latest updates it will install it and what I am trying to say is Windows keeps finding these bugs and all things and they keep fixing it what you need to do is just update your system and the bug will be automatically fixed I hope this helped uh, leave a like leave a subscribe if it did and thanks for watching